Welcome back to WENY News, everybody. I'm Renata Steele, and we are joined by author Megan Schull today. Uh, Megan, we want to thank you so much for joining us, and we want to talk all about your new book that you've got coming out. Uh, but first, we want to learn a little bit about you. You're based in Ithaca. Um, you're a local author. And so tell us a little bit about us and your background. Sure. Thank you for having me. Uh, so I grew up here in Ithaca, and I've lived here my whole life. So I'm I'm Ithaca through and through. Uh, went you know grew up local schools and ended up going to Cornell. Yeah, so I, I just love the Finger Lakes region. Why leave? You know it's so beautiful here. I love the people, the waterfalls. Um, so most of my books uh, are not based. Actually, my very first books were with American Girl. Um, and those actually were based in Ithaca, but that was like 20 years ago. So I've gone on to write more and more books and this is my sixth novel and it's coming out September 13th. And it's, uh, yeah, there's a, it, I'm, I'm just super excited. My last two, um, books have become movies. One is a Disney movie, the swap, which you can watch now on the Disney channel or Disney plus. And uh, my next book got optioned by Paramount. Um, so that's in process of being made into a movie with um, Will Smith's company bought it. So yeah, I've had some good fortune. This new book is coming out with Penguin Random House and it's my jam is pretty much for middle school age, um, about 10 to 14. And uh, your new book is called Billion Dollar Girl. And you mentioned that you um, really kind of uh, uh, direct some of your writing towards that specific age group. And there's, there's reasons for that. Why, why you kind of, um, write to that sort of audience. Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, I actually did my doctorate at Cornell and it specialized in like how to help kids build resilience. And one of the ways you can help kids build resilience is help them know they're not alone. And interestingly enough, that's by telling them authentic stories. So as opposed to like what they see on TV with the Kardashians and the endless scrolling on social media where everything is like about fame and money and excess. So how do you counteract that? You tell them real stories. And um, I kind of flipped that on its head because my stories, although they feel very real, they're obviously fiction, <laughs> but the whole, my whole heart is in it to help kids feel more resilient, less alone, um, especially right now, post pandemic and, you know, gun violence, all the crazy things happening in the chaos of the world. It's just amazing that a book can soothe and provide comfort and help kids know that they're not alone and that, um, you know, hopefully provide a little window of hope. So um, this new book, it's, it's in a world where kids are constantly told about excess and, and money and um, fame, it sort of flips that on its head and explores like what, what do we really value and what should we really value? And I, I guess the story offers some answers to that in my heart and, and hopefully kids will be nourished by it too. And now you've got a big party coming up uh, to celebrate the book, and it's really turned into a wonderful uh, community event. So will you tell us about your upcoming uh, super fun party in the park on September 13th? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Everyone's invited in the listening area. Um, so excited um, to invite uh, this whole region to this wonderful event we're having, and we're partnering with Family and Children's Service of Ithaca. And uh, Odyssey Bookstore, which is a local awesome indie bookstore, and they're going to have books right on site at Stort Park, which is the, a beautiful park at the base of Cuga Lake and in Ithaca at the southernmost point. And we're going to be right there at the base of the lake from 6 to 8.30 on September 13th. And we hope, you know, people drop by, especially kids, caregivers, family, friends who are interested in maybe reading a book together, picking a book up. We're going to have some surprises there. Wegmans is involved. Um, that's, that's a little hint that there's going to be something sweet, um, but I'll be there. Um, I'll be signing books and yeah, it's just a great time for uh, something positive for kids today. And um, I, at least for here, it's the second week of school, but I'm sure that differs everywhere. But it's uh, Tuesday, September 13th, 
6 to 8.30 at Stort Park. And now, Megan, if people want to learn more about you or your books or your TV show or everything else mm-hmm. that you've got uh, going on, what's the best way they can do that? Absolutely. Well, they can pre-order Billion Dollar Girl. I got to give that a shout out. And you can do that anywhere books are sold. And that's coming out September 13th. But you can also check out my website, which is hey Megan, like hey Megan.com. And I'll just hold up the book for the first time in the whole wide world because I just opened the box today. So this is coming out September 13th and it's a pretty, pretty thick read as you can see. So it's like not little kids books, but middle grade, they call it. And um, yeah, I hope to meet you all. Well, great. Well, Megan, thank you so much. And of course, we're going to put all of this information on our website, weny.com. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Renata.